Hi, Internet and Casey. This is Melly with 25 and 52. I didn't like the first intro I recorded, so my hair is drier now. Um, and I'm recording another one. I don't have anything particularly neat to talk about this week. Um, my job's pretty much the same as it has been. Stress has died down a little bit, but I still feel like I'm going to be behind it forever, and I keep discovering new ways that our workload is going to be accidentally added to over time. So that'll be fun. Anyway, check out this other stuff I talked about. This past weekend, I went to Omaha for a wedding. It was pretty great. It's nowhere near the kind of wedding I would like to have were I to ever have a wedding. Um, but it seemed like exactly what the bride and groom wanted. Um, everything was gorgeous. Everything went well. You know, I even had some fun. So, and I went on road trips, and I always like road trips. Um, now, Omaha... I did not have high hopes for the place, not gonna lie, because, you know, kind of bought into the stereotype of, like, a uh, hip hill, small city, I don't know. Um, and since the wedding stuff was all, you know, wedding events, it was at places or at, you know, someone's house in a nice suburb-type area. Like, you know, I just, I didn't see a lot of a uh, city, and I was really hoping to see a city. Um, so, before we left on Sunday, we managed to get into downtown Omaha, and this old market neighborhood, which is a little kitschy. It reminded me a lot of uh, Printer's Row in Chicago. Um, there were a lot of antique stores, and I got this t-shirt that was designed by a local artist, um, and other just cool stuff, lots of bar and grill type food, uh, cobblestone streets, you know, it was real cute. Uh, something interesting I noticed uh, on the way back is that in Iowa, the... You know how in most places it's, um, like, for uh, gas, octane, whatever, it's uh, 87, 89, 91, both in terms of that, in terms of prices, the, you know, 87 is the lowest, uh, and then it goes up. Um, due to some weird tax incentive thing I don't entirely understand, I think it has to do with the corn ethanol, um, in Iowa it's 89, 87, 91. So we got nicer gas for much cheaper. <laughs> um... So, you know, that was that was pretty cool. Uh, actually, in looking into why, I just Googled around a little bit for this, and uh, it turns out that uh, there there's this uh, message board that people were asking this question about back in 2000, and someone's like, oh, when I'm paying $1.60 for gas, I certainly hope. And I'm like, oh, honey, I wish I was paying $1.60 for gas at all. <laughs> um, the cat is doing a real cute thing. Oh. Look at those little feet. Look at the cat feet. He's so cute. Little cat feet. Oh, 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 little cat claws. Anyway, so I'm going to respond to your video a little bit and talk some about self care. Uh, some things that I do personally are I try to end up in a situation <laughs> where no one will bother me. I am hella introverted, uh, and so I read books, and I spin yarn, and I crochet things, and I do it in my room with the doors closed and the window open. Um, or I go to a Starbucks or other coffee shop, um, or like the bakery in downtown Skokie, where, you know, no one random is going to walk in and start trying to talk to me. Basically, I recharge either by being by myself, you know, or by small group one-on-one -on -one communication with somebody um by the way i know i mentioned uh basil and strawberry plants in our last videos and this one on the left here's the basil and that red pot on the right is supposed to have strawberry plants in it but some kitty ate them all the middle plant uh, is some attempted uh, transplanting from my dad's garden of uh, a couple of spearmint plants so um we're still not sure it looks like some of them have not died but some of them have uh, I've taken out the worst, and I think they even have some new ones in there. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> High five. Wow. <laughs>